Hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to our channel and an uh, interesting video today because before this video, we reach out to many power supply brands and tell them that we have a secret sauce machine that we use 3 Ethereum to purchase to test new particular hardware. And the only brand that came back to us who, who is really serious and game on was Kuga or more specifically Kuga Gaming, a premium PC hardware brand that is very notable in Asia market as well as the European market. And when we tell them that our plan is, they told us back and say, yeah, we are on board. We'll pass you the full series of the GX series. This is basically their 80 plus Go full modular power supply that is targeted towards performance content creation uh, editing stations for your videographer, color correction, colorista, you know, film DP, you name it, they got your back. As well as for the gamers out there, those high-end PC builds. And they give us a full range from 650, 750, 850, and 1050 watts. Like you see right here. So there are two benefits of having power supply that is full modular. The first is cable management. You use the cable that you need for your current hardware as you progress by upgrading your hardware, maybe adding storage, changing to a high-end graphics card that need more cable lanes or you know RGB products, you add the cable to your needs. Thus, you don't have too much mess in your PC build. The second will be also aesthetics. You can use custom cables to color match like those color sleeving like orange, yellow, blue, white, you name it. You can use colors to match your team build and setup, but you also can have custom length so you don't have extra cable that you have to find a way to hide in your PC build. Let's talk about performance. First of all, here is a detailed comparison of the 12 volt rail for each wattage power supply. You may use this number to match your hardware that you're getting. If your bill calls for, let's say, 650 watts, do get at least a tier higher like 750 for some flexibility and ensure there is no bottleneck on your system. Now, most tech guys use wall tester to justify power supply performance, but we are using an industry-grade tester called the Sun Moon SM8800 with an automated software kit that you can key in all the parameters for testing. We have tested each power supply ranging from 650 to So here is our results. Performance wise, there's two areas to look at. The output of the 12 volt rail in terms of percentage and whether it hits the 80 plus goal rating, which they do deliver based on my results right here. But don't take my word for it. There's also another verified organization that tests power supplies called Clear Results. Just type in the model name and you'll see them individually. Here's their version of the 80 plus report, which I'll include links in the video description, but they also deliver the 80 plus goal rating. So here's the summary. Using our Sun Moon power tester as well as looking at the results, the PDF report of clear results, the GX series by Koga do deliver its promise of being an 80 plus Go rated power supply starting from a 650 to 1050. You're good to go. Now clear results definitely have a lower percentage but it still hits the 80 plus Go rating versus our results. I can safely assume they are using like high-end industrial grade, multiple runs, specific tests. That's why the percentage is lower than us. Whereas our Sun Moon power tester is more of a commercial ready power supply where people can spend a few thousand, get it to test power supplies for warranty or just for hobbies like us because we want new toys. I'm a geek for tech stuff. Just to test power supplies because why not? It's a new hobby. I can just go out and buy in the market new power supplies and test it for hobby sake because why not? But jokes aside, I always recommend my buddies and my viewers to always get gold rated power supply because of efficiency. And if you are staying in a country like me, Malaysia, our cost per watt for electricity do increase over time and we do not want to pay our government too much indirect power supply tax to the government. So yeah, having an efficient power supply means you can save money over time. The initial investment for gold power supply range tends to be expensive but you get the rewards over time. Plus, you can use this for five years and beyond because this has a warranty up to five years. So you're good 
to go when it comes to efficiency, guarantee as well as warranty. So I'll leave some links down below for the Malaysian market as well as the international market where you can get this GX series. Let me know in the comments what power supply next we should uh, hunt <laughs> because we got a new toy and we can hunt. And let me know in the comments below what PC hardware you're set using set up right now, your processor, motherboard and power supply. And let me know. I want to know. I love to know. And I need to go get Starbucks because it's like literally 12 a.m. in the morning. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Sayonara. And subscribe. Subscribe. Like this video. Subscribe. Alright, bye-bye. But subscribe. <laughs>